San Luis Obispo hasn't beaten Arroyo Grande since way back in 2008, so the odds of the Eagles winning tonight were pretty good, but hey, if Katy Perry and Taylor Swift can be besties again, then anything is possible, Tiger fans. First quarter, Emilio Corona going down the field on the opening drive and finding Max Soltero in the end zone. 7-0 Tigers, right back come the Eagles with the ball, but Ethan Royals pass is picked off going the other way, thanks to Luke Edwards. Edwards all over that one, taking it down to the goal line. I personally thought it was in, but the ref said no. So on the next play, the Tigers will find the end zone as they give it to Anthony Arroyo, and he pounds it in from a yard out. And the Tigers are now up 14 to nothing. Man, didn't see that coming. Neither did the Eagles. To the second quarter we go now. Arroyo Grande on the goal line. Royal giving it to Caleb Thomason, and he'll fight his way into the end zone. And we're now tied up at 14, so we've got a ball game to the third quarter now, still tied at 14. Corona hooking up again with Soltero, making it 21 to 14 now. Tigers, best duo since Brady and Gronk, or maybe even Sting and Shaggy. Eagles marching right back down the field now. Thomason again finding the end zone on a 15-yard run, and now we're knotted up at 21. But later, Arroyo going to find the end zone again for his second touchdown on the night as the Tigers go on to shock the Eagles, taking this one 28-21. to I was. <laughs> 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 